Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Rogue Tech Hold Forged. So, as you can hear, my tongue is still messed up, so I'm going to have a hard time talking again today. But, we will be doing an episode. So, um, what I did was I restored the four light mechs we're planning on going with for our lighter lance. So, I'm just going to quickly outfit these guys. Let's have a look at the urban mechs first. And... We're going to go with half decent size engines here. So 160s, I think, in both of these guys. And we got enough ferro and endo steel. So we're going to do that. Um, we're going to use the injury cockpits on these guys. We don't have much else. And I think we've got enough uh, ECMs here. We do. So we're going to use an ECM. See what we can get out of this. Max out the armor first. And then we can um, go to weapons here. And what I'm thinking of is uh, ballistic. And going with, um, where are we here? A, nope, not that one. Light rifle. And... I think it was three machine guns I had set out in here, like that. And we want to do um, half a ton of ammo, I think. Wait, this is 12 per. We're going to need a full ton, I think. So let's just take the regular ammo, throw it in the leg. Let's put it in the other leg, though. And we want to do, let's get some heat sinks here. We need a few. Uh, where are we here? Here we go. And we can put four in for free. So let's do that. All right. And our heat is looking pretty good here, I think. Yeah. So we can take a weapon here. We're going to go to lasers. And probably drop in. Um, let's see here. So we got a couple of maybe a medium pulse laser in the arm. Mm, too much heat, I think. Let's go with just a regular medium. Actually, if we go with a... Uh, where's our... Here we go. That's basically the same as a medium, medium laser with the exception of heat. But... Well, you know what? Let's just do one medium laser here. And then we can put one heat sink in. I think that'll be it. So yeah, we're looking pretty good here. Um, I, think so. I think that's all we need to do for this guy. Yeah. Either that or we can go with another machine gun. But I think I would rather go this route. Let's confirm this. And in the second urban mech, we can outfit the same way. So I think we got all, we got enough gear for this too. So Pharaoh, Endo, Max Armor. Um, five heat sinks. And we've got, oops, here. Got another 260 engine, or 160 I mean. That's going to give us a 275, 250 kilometers an hour, so it's pretty good. Um, pretty quick. We can go with the 180 if we want to, but I think this is probably better. Yeah. Um, and then we need to do... Where are we here? Um, light rifle. And three machine guns. Ammo and a medium laser. And what are we missing? Oh, yeah, cockpit and ECM. So we've got another injury cockpit, protect the pilot, and a regular EC. Was it this one or the Guardian we had? 
I think it was the Guardian, wasn't it? Yeah. Mm hmm. And that's what we can do for this guy. So we're going to confirm this. Alrighty. Crapple Master. Let's refit this guy. Alright, so this guy we want to be fast as well. So let's go down here. Oops, just engines. A 150, I think it was I wanted to use in this guy. And he'll be 275, yep. And then we need four heat sinks. So one, two, three, four. Okay. And then ferro, endo steel. And our cockpit is going to be in this one. Um, wait. This one. No, let's go with injury resist, just in case. Um, upper arms here, so hands on this guy. And then we can do, um, was it the guard? No, it was this one I wanted with this guy, right? Yeah, this one and this guy, regular ECM. And then we want to go to Ballistic and go down here. And let's put in, I think it was a light machine gun array in two. Do we have light machine guns? We do. I can't remember if it was this way I wanted to go. Because this is a shorter range, I think. 440. Yeah, so this is fine. So that's, we're going to need a full ton and a half, I think, of ammo. So, like so. Um, and then we wanted to do a laser. And we're going to put two flamers on the other side, I think. Um, clan flamers, so I think. Like so, and then we need heat sinks, right? So, a couple of regular heat sinks. Now, we can do this a little differently, I think. Oh, we're over now. Hang on a minute. What did I do? Oh, yeah, right. That, and then, uh, sorry, it's up here. Patchwork, and then we can take one point off the CT back, and that should be it for this guy. Oh, wait, we didn't max out the armor. That's what I didn't do. Um, what did I do differently this time? I'm missing something here. Hang on. I think it was the machine gun array I didn't use. Let's, um, max the armor first, just so I know where we are here. I think this is what I did here. Uh, was it this way? No, it wasn't this way. Um, still don't have maximum armor. armor. I did something wrong here. I think it's diffusion core. I think we used a, uh, no, that's the smallest one I used. Hmm. Did I put an XL gyro in here? Or an XL engine? I think I did. I think that's what I did. Yeah, I think that's what I did. Sorry, I kind of laid these out already, just so I know what I was doing here, so I wasn't wasting any time. Um, right. Yeah, that was what I did, and then it was. Uh, yeah, heat's a little over, but not much. So we're going to run this one on this way, confirm this, and then the spider. Okay, this guy's going to be our melee mech, and I think I I think I used heavy ferro, but I want to use the NSS I think on this guy. Um, on XL engine was in here, then we had. Um, What was our core now? I think it was a 200 or was it a 180? I think it was a 180. Yeah, 275, 180, yep. 
Okay. Uh, and then we had um, hammer fist in one arm and a spike wrecking ball in another. And then we did, um, or I did, uh, we needed a three heat sinks. So one, two, three. Need to max out the armor. All right, so that's all maxed, that's all maxed out now. Then we had um, Pirate Spiked Helmet for plus 10 damage, plus 10% 10 damage, that is. Hands on each side for accuracy. Uh, defensive Gyro I had in here. Um, sorry, did I have... No. It was these guys I had in here. And then ECM we needed in the head. Right? And I think that was it because I can't fit anything else in here. Yeah, that's what we had in this guy. Or at least I had in this guy. But I remember. So he's melee only. Yeah, that was it. Okay, let's confirm that too. Right. So while those guys are getting up and running, we are going to take a mission right now. Um, and we're going to go with uh, Liberation. Pirate Band is taking control of the base. We need to destroy it. Going to max out our salvage on this one as well. Hopefully we can get some pirate stuff off this one, but we'll see. And we're going to run with our mid lance. So we're going to run a Yager mech this time, I think. I want to see how that works out. And the Bushwhacker Wolverine Shadowhawk. And then let's run with... Um, so our leader is Raider. You can see we have a few new pilots here for the, for the next lance. Um, Raider, Hogweed, Warlock, and Recoil. Alright, here we go. Oh, good. Okay. So while we, while we move up, I want to talk about a couple things. First thing is that I got the latest version of Rogue Tech finally downloaded. So Funky Steve's Medina's is now updated to the latest version of Rogue Tech. So on Sunday, when that comes out, that'll be tomorrow after you guys see this episode, um, it will be up with the latest version, which is good. Um, the second thing is, is that um, Fists of Dorn has uh, recommended that um, I look into getting the a different version of the original uh, Road Tech for this particular um, series um, to change it so that we can get the planets having their individual difficulties rather than going by uh, um, our company strength. So we can run our lighter lances against lighter targets, which I think is a great idea. So we're going to do that. Um, I got to make sure I back up the uh, save game and everything, or the, at least the folder with everything in it. And um, then I'm going to attempt to do that. So that should be good. So that hopefully um, after the weekend, we'll be having a, uh, a uh, difficulty based on planet with this series. I also got to talk about where this series is going because once again we're using a dead end. We've it's been dead end since you know Flashpoint came out, but this particular series is on a dead end version of Rogue Tech. If you guys are liking it, I'll keep going with it. That's great. Um, if you want to see more of the new Rogue Tech action, I can get a switch over from this series to another series, um, continuing with Funky Steve's Medina's, and then maybe doing another um, not Cold Forged but uh, colder colder forged series or something like that. Um, just a thought, anyway. So, yeah. Let's reserve this. So, on Funky Steve's Medina's, I also have the uh, difficulty based on planet installed now, so that should be fun. Okay, can we get eyes on? We can. Just get over here. Alright, let's get serious on these guys. Commando, meh. Don't expect much resistance here. Probably some reinforcements after this though. Oh, catapult, nice. It's 
it's a classic bolt. Damage is light. It's a 215 inch, right? Two RM20s. Oh, nice. All right. Um, Commander. All right, Raider. Let's just try out this Jaeger mech. Can we get to a point? There we go. I'm there. Well, not a bad chance to hit with those Gauss rifles. It's a lot better than I thought it would be. Okay, we're in a cold environment, so that's pretty good heat sinking. Zero heat, nice. Good to go. Good to go. Good to go in the snow. Hit these guys. Well, yeah, this is way better with the PPCs and Ultra 5 though. I copy. Bushwhacker just a far superior mech. Yeah. The fact that you can put um, the uh, arm weapon mounts on it makes all the difference in the world. Uh, let's go let's go for a headshot in this guy. Take this. Mm -hmm. a critical hit. <laughs> eh, he's gonna die. They've got a lock on me. Should use that first, guys. Alright, I take that back. Okay, damage is light. Alright, see what they do here. Okay, he's coming into punch range here. Slice damage. Hold in firm. These guys are trying to flank us, I guess. Can't get behind this guy? Guess not. Alright, let's hit him from this side though. Targeting for physical attack. Going down. Okay. Are these? Engaging multiple targets. Nice. Leroy Jenkins. That hit something good. Watch that just the other day again. Man, that video is awesome. Right here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Funny as I knew guys guys that were like that. They just had no control. <laughs> they were also hoot, but still, it's like they never helped in raids. But you do. We'll deal with that in a minute. Next turn. Actually, this turn. Start dealing with these guys. What do we got here? Camouflage LRM? Eh. SRM 6s. That's in range though. Can we take. Let's multi target this out. So 
So 130 on A. One, two, three, four. And then put these guys on B. Won't be able to kill B, but it'll be a good start. Nice. Just want to make sure we got it. It was a bit overkill, but we had a 73% chance to hit. And, you know, when you shoot gas rifles like that, <laughs> you got to make sure you're hitting the other guy. Wow, that was bad. Didn't they have like 80-something percent chance to hit? Where are these guys going? Fine, you're dragging it out now, guys. Okay, let's get the whacker over the hill. You. Moving out. Deal a death blow to this turret. Okay. That turret is gone. There better be reinforcements. Shot your own crane, man. I wonder how that crane operator felt about that. I used to work with a guy that used to be a crane operator when he was younger. He was an older guy, Japanese guy, and uh, he worked on um, um, cranes on all kinds of high rises and stuff. And he told me that uh, the worst thing he ever did was working on a crane on a uh, freighter, or not a freighter, a barge in the uh, St. Lawrence River. Scariest job he said he ever had because the barge would wobble back and forth. All right, shoot at this guy. He was always afraid of going in the water. Okay, that one's done. Good shot, Commander. Enemy structure down. I was really hoping for some pirate gear here. A couple of vehicles over here, and you just squash, buddy. Man, my tongue is killing me. I'm receiving you. Okay. Ah, oh, good. More meat for the slaughter. Frying on this guy. There we go. Turret destroyed, Commander. Okay, they're over here. Oh, two, two sides. There and there. Um, see if we can get some eyes on here. With the vehicles. Not with the vehicles, though, I guess. Oh, I can. Eh. I want to get on these other mechs though. Let's get down here. Piece of cake. Okay. Sure, why not? I'm gonna make some trash. Why not? Okay, hey, Warlock. Can't see that tower from up here, but I can see this vehicle. Hunter, yeah, good armor, so we're gonna hit it with everything. Yeah, not quite enough. Yeah, not too bad though. Not too bad. Commander. Copy that. Okay. A pole, eh? Let's 
put these guys on B, the other one on A. Okay, nice. That's a start. Waiting for orders. Um. Oh. See the post from over here. Huh. That's it. Yeah, let's go this route. If we hit everything on B, then we should be able to kill the building. Roger. Oh, not too bad. Hit with one of the gosses anyway. There we go. Two down. Jumping? Yep. Jumping with alarm 10. Distance holding. 60 ton. Grasshopper maybe? That's a 15. Thunderbolt, maybe? Maybe? 65, yeah, it could be a Thunderbolt. Okay, so at least we got some heavier guys coming in here. Mech warriors, show them what you got. No, because if I looked at my kilt, they'd run away. Okay, Jenner's gotta go. Uh ready for orders. Let's kill that pole if we can. Can't shoot it from anywhere, I guess, eh? So let's move over here then. Going full throttle. Got the range. Let's use it. Let's target this guy. We need to get them eyes off. Nice shooting, man. That's a turret, I guess, eh? I'm listening. I'm listening. Let's target that Poe. Mm -hmm. Peace, oh crap, fire. I shouldn't call it that. It's got a lot of armor. Just not enough. Yes, command. Let's get eyes on this jerk over here. No problem. What is that? Ban what is that? Banshee. Okay. I think we got a few Banshee projects kicking around too. Let's fire on this guy. Nice. Okay, one Thunderbolt I don't have to worry about. Yeah, he's going to be dead here in a second. Going to put both Goss rifles into him. Hopefully I can stay hidden from this Banshee. Yeah, it looks like I can. I'm gonna save my armor for later, fire everything. Yeah, there's no point in staying around now, eh, buddy? At least you got smart. Uh oh. Thought it was a back shot there for a second. Here he comes. Being shitty. Oh, he's running. That's actually a really smart move. He's undercover. Good thinking, buddy. Oh, it is. Oh, 
We're in range of everything, so let's do it. Okay. Good luck with that. Yes, Commander. Can we go as in that turret anywhere? Nope. Understood. Moving fast. Okay. Huh. That should be the end of the buildings. Get your lens to the LZ commander. I'm coming in hot. No joy. Well, two to three ain't bad. Commander. Commander. Let's give that banshee some missiles. Eighty seven percent, eh? Might as well give it a chance. Three chances for a headshot. It's going down anyway though, so that's good. Eh. It's a start. Okay, Raider. Turret. Moving out. Let's finish this guy up. And dump it all in there. I know I'm wasting ammo, but why not? Target down. Don't think we're in too much of a threat here. Okay, what's this guy going to do? Probably going to melee, if I was him. Actually, I'd turn my back to the rock and shoot this guy, but... That's what I would do. Wow, that was a really, really bad move. Right here. Mm -hmm. I got it. Don't think. Don't shoot. Just run. Ah, oh, guns out the field, guys. Guns out the field. Here goes it. I think I hit something special there. See if we can get him to bail out. Good to go. Hit him from the side so we don't blow his back up. Okay, knock him down. Solid connection on that one. Down to one now. Oh, two. Okay. Orders. Let's get in the forest here. Moving to position. Quick draw. Okay. Oh, well, I thought it was a grasshopper. Forgot all about the quick draw. Inflicted some heavy damage. Gonna stay unstable, are ya? Good thinking. Thanks for coming out. Alright, Raider. Just walk forward like this. And we're going to do, try and like this guy. Wow, they both missed. At least we knocked him down.
Thunderbolt. Didn't even shoot. Interesting. I guess he couldn't see anybody. Should have just reserved. What's this guy doing? Wow. Look at the post. Here it comes. Right into the head of the... No. <laughs> I was going to say, right into the head of the quick draw. Uh, recoil. Okay. Let's do it again. Um, same side. I was been hit heavily in the head. Down to one. Commander. Uh, let's get eyes on this other guy. Delirious, but we can see him already. So let's, uh, yeah, side shot him. Get some stability back. Standard Thunderbolt. Really crappy armor, though. The old version, I guess. Just dump everything into him. Okay. Yeah. Let's get you around this side. No, you're not the best for called shots, but uh, let's try for this leg. See if we can take it. That's spread it around. Perfect. Spread it around. Thanks for showing up, buddy. Minimal damage on that hit. Waiting for orders. Hmm. Yeah. I. Copy that, Commander. Cut the left leg. Left torso. Guard a critical hit. At least he's not going anywhere. Should just be able to hit him with machine guns and maybe knock him down. Okay, um... Oh! Is the Banshee dead? Did he bail out? I guess he did. Um, yeah, man. Piece of cake. Whoa. Nice. Nice. <laughs> You're parroting me again, man. Stop parroting me. Okay, how much damage does this guy got on this side here? Not bad. Multi-target here and here. B is going to take the PPCs. Oh, took his head off. Nice. Target's taking a critical hit. Or maybe I torsoed him. That could have been it, too. Didn't say left torso, though. Mm-hmm. Finish this up, guys. Groin shot. I'm guessing you didn't like that, did ya? I'm receiving you. Nice shot to the pills. Copy that, Commander. See if we can take that other leg. Engaging target. Whoops. Oh, we got both legs. Okay, good. That's a salvage. Mission successful. Alright, so I'm real pirate gear off that though, but 231,000. More than enough for repairs. And yeah, no no real damage per se. I think I like the, the Jaeger mech loadout though. It's working really nice. Um, hopefully we get a lot of parts here. See what happens. Um, Okay, down here, what do we got? Anything good? 
Um, take that for a lighter lance. We got a few of those. We should probably we should probably we should probably have put them in. Spot liner. Take that. That's useful. Um, what else do we have here? Yeah, I'm gonna take the big cores in case we need to sell them. Cause there really isn't much else here. Got lots of endo still. Two left. So yeah, we'll go that route. Let's see what we get with mech, mech parts now. One, two Banshee parts, two Catapult parts, three Jenner, and a Quick Draw. Okay, not bad. Not bad at all. And an extra engine. Alright, 26,000 repairs. That's nothing. Seven days. Cool. Alright, so we got bigger repair times than we've had before. Um, let's leave these guys in here. So we can get them done a little faster and ha have a chance for another mission. And then let's move... No, let's leave it like that. These guys are going to take a while. So, yeah, we'll just leave it like that, I think. And, um... I think because my tongue is killing me, we're going to leave the episode here. Sorry I can't do two mission missions again today, guys, but I'm hoping tomorrow my tongue will be better and I can at least maybe get two missions done. But right now it's really sore. So I'm going to leave it here. If you liked the video, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you all later.